David Campbell Bannerman. Well, I mean, I, obviously it's of concern, air pollution. I have a touch of asthma myself, you know, I'm sensitive to it. Um, and we've had the Sahara, we have some funny weather conditions, Sahara sand in, thrown in as well. Um, I mean, I think these targets are valid, but I don't see why the EU should be imposing them on us from a great distance. I think, you know, you've seen, I think it should be localism again. It should be sort of decided at, at a local level. But they're saying they can't um, afford it. Well, I mean, we could some of the savings, the 12 billion we're going to get back from the EU when we leave, could be put towards that end. I and mean, literally, we'll be in charge again as a country. We'll have uh, a lot more extra cash saved. We could put it towards a good local. But we wouldn't spending. have had that. We wouldn't have had the levels if we hadn't been in the EU, would we? Well, we've got a lot of pressure population. As I was saying earlier, you know, our population is increasing enormously. It's gone up seven million since your government were in power. Seven million. It's it's larger than many of the EU members. Um, it, there's a lot of crush in the east of England, we know that. Uh, it's getting worse. Uh, we, have, we have three times as many people with national insurance numbers yeah. than actually so those Just give me an answer, arriving. what are we going to do about the, the pollution levels? <laughs> well, we've got standing traffic. I think traffic, you right. know, investment okay. on infrastructure is right. essential. Yeah.